Dead Pudding Society is a really lovely episode of The Simpsons. The title itself is something that I love because I'm a big fan of Dead Port Society. It's one of my top two all-time favourite films, so I love that little reference there. This is the sixth episode of the second season, directed by Rich Moore. This aired in November 1990, and I absolutely love this for several reasons. The first is that I just really like the narrative, but there are some really great messages in it as well. And we also get to see inside the Flanders house, and I think this is the first time we actually go inside the Flanders home. I could be wrong, but I'm pretty sure it's the first time. And Homer ends up going down into Ned Flanders' basement, and he realises that it's basically Homer's version of heaven. There's, you know, there's a pool table, there's a, a, a bar, and he's kind of thinks that Ned Flanders is making fun of him. And one thing leads to another, and Bart and Todd, Todd Flanders, Ned's son of course, end up going head to head in a miniature golf competition. And the majority of the episode is Bart preparing for this competition and really feeling the pressure and really feeling like that he can't perform and I guess do his father proud. And it's one of the few times where we see Bart actually worrying about his ability to do something. I don't think it's entirely because he wants to win for Homer, but I think he doesn't want to be branded a loser, particularly against Todd Flanders. I think Lisa's involvement in this is lovely. Um, <laughs> I still really thoroughly uh, am amused by Bart's response um, when Lisa asks, what does one hand clapping sound like? And Bart provides what I think is a perf perfectly reasonable response. And to me, that question just doesn't make any sense, because that is what it sounds like. The tree falling in the woods, yes, fair enough, although, you know, video cameras prove that it does make a sound. And I think it's a lot of fun seeing Bart prepare for this and the stages he goes through. But ultimately, it's more about Homer and Ned and the feud that they have and the bet that they make. In case you haven't seen the episode... I won't say what the bet is, but I'm really pleased with what the bet was because I thought it was an absolutely fantastic idea. Writing out the rules of the bet I thought was brilliant, particularly with something that happens later on and the wording of the bet. I really thoroughly enjoyed it. I won't say what happens at the end, but I do think the outcome was perfect. I think it had some really lovely messages in it. It's a lot of fun. It's quite a brightly coloured episode. And I just also want to point out how fantastic, and this is... This doesn't really need to be said, but how fantastic Dan Castellaneta is with voiceover work. Because when I heard the voiceover for the commentator who was commentating on the golf tournament, I thought that sounds, that's a brilliant voice. I want to see who's doing that. It's Dan Castellaneta, who of course voices Homer Simpson. And I believe he also voiced Todd in this. So his vocal range is just absolutely astounding. And I know that that's kind of a given. We know he's fantastic. But I just wasn't expecting it to be him. I'm really, truly amazed at his performance. Across the board, of course, that's always true. Really enjoyed this episode. It's a lot of fun. Some great messages. Very funny. Very cleverly written. Very well done. Beautifully animated. A lot of little gags throughout it. I really can't fault it.